Hey, this is Derek at Tech Connection. This video is going to be about adding RAM to an Alienware X51 uh, entertainment PC. It's a really easy process. This will just take a couple of minutes. So I got my RAM upgrade. I got my computer. And all you're going to need after that is a Phillips screwdriver. So let's start. First thing you're going to do is lay your machine down. Take your screwdriver and you're looking for the screw right in the back, right there. That's the only screw you need to take the cover off. So we'll do that right now. Make a slight adjustment here. There we go. Okay. Don't lose that screw. All right, so now that that's been removed, you're going to push your top cover forward or pull it, whatever works doesn't take much effort. Very carefully, gently lift it. Reason being is it's still attached, so don't just yank the cover off and fling it away. Or you'll be very sad. Next, the CD-ROM. There's a screw right there that we're going to want to move. Okay, so we'll take that out. Pretty easy screw to remove. Power cable for the CD-ROM you're going to want to remove. And with that loosened, the CD-ROM will come backwards and then just lift right out. Just set it over there. And now you have access to the internals. The RAM lever is right here, so you're going to push that. Remove the memory that's in place. Take your upgrade and slide it into position. Make sure it snaps. And then get the other side. So I got two sticks that I'm doing. Make sure you feel that click into position. And then we're done there. So what we're going to do now is reattach our uh, power to the CD-ROM. Okay. And we're going to take this unit and slide him back into position. Over here on this angle, you just want to get these grooves to line up. And you'll kind of feel that slide into place. And then you're going to tighten your screw again. This is this is the close-up procedure. We're done here. That was the RAM upgrade, just like that. Couldn't get any easier. Put your case back on. Now for the case, take a moment to kind of push that beneath. Make sure you don't accidentally crimp that or otherwise damage it. Then the case will go on very similar to the way it came off where it snaps. Which is really hard with one hand. There we go. So once you got it, reattach your screw. You're good to go. That's the whole procedure. In a future video I may uh, do a SSD upgrade. Usually that involves disconnecting the optical drive, but I'm going to need it for my next project, so I'm not going to do it during this, uh, during this video. You can also do a video card swap out, which I will definitely be doing, and I'll try and film that process. If you've got any questions, just drop me a line on the comments. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.